driving north along the east coast of Michigan's thumb, from Port Huron, Michigan to Harbor Beach, Michigan. I've been plotting out using photo pills, some possible moon photographs of the Harbor Beach lighthouse um, to continue on with the moon or nighttime or astrological photographs of Michigan's lighthouses, what I figure would be a multi-year project. And I see a couple potential dates coming up, but uh, where I need to stand and where I need to be, I just need to take a trip up there first to make sure that we can actually get to that location and that it'll, it'll work. Um, one thing I want to mention, the last uh, uh, lighthouse I did was the Big Red Lighthouse in Holland, Michigan, and that's where I had the idea that we would start doing these moon or astrological photographs of the uh, Michigan's lighthouses, and there are a lot of them out. The plan right now is to drive up there on Saturday night, Sunday morning. Um, there's gonna be a, uh, I believe it's a half moon um, that'll be rising, um, that uh, will be in the lighthouse, will be just a, a nice view of that, but it's gonna depend on the ambient light, how much ambient light there is at that lighthouse, and what we find when we're there. Okay, we've arrived, but uh, in a little different place than I thought we could get to. It turns out that the point of land that I had chosen looks to be gated from a factory entrance, and so I can't get there. So now we have to plot things out, but we can see that the lighthouse is there. We've got a pier. Uh, I'm going to be heading out on that pier in just a couple of minutes, and we're going to see what uh, where things line up. I don't think I'm going to be venturing forward beyond this point, especially since we're a barricade. Oh, it actually says, do not go beyond this point. But we have the lighthouse, and there's a fog on the water, so I'm going to try to get a couple of quick shots of that. Where I want to be is right along that stretch of land, so I have to see if there's any way that I can get to that. So I've spotted this gazebo over here, and I think that might actually give us the angle and we'll still be on public land, and uh, so we're going to scope that out and see if that works. Well, this is what I saw from that spot using the augmented reality with photo pills. It was so foggy, I could not tell where the lighthouse was. And I thought it was in the frame, and it was not. So that gazebo absolutely would not work for a spot to photograph the lighthouse. So it's a foggy Friday morning uh, in preparation for a Sunday night, or actually Sunday early morning, Saturday night shoot. Uh, with a half moon rise over the Harbor Beach Lighthouse. We shall see if the weather cooperates. So checking photo pills later, I looked at the spot. This is the spot where I'd need to be, where I'd have to stand in order to be able to see the lighthouse, the moon over it, and the, the shot that I was hoping for. There is no other spot to be um, to get that shot on that day other than right there. So that was a non-starter. So I'm still determined to get these photographs of the lighthouses, so I needed to come up with a plan B, and that's what I found right here. And actually, right at the pier, right where we were, where we walked out and it was so windy, I can get a shot on August 12th 
of the moon and the lighthouse. It looks like it's actually going to end up being a better photograph than what I originally thought. So we're going to go for that and that'll happen on a later video.